Hello everyone, today I'm sharing a flip through of my winter notebook. This is the full traveler's notebook I have where I store my current notebooks. Um, I got this in a German shop and this is the notebook for photos of my daughter. And I'm making those notebooks for my kids to have them later when they're older. This is for my son. And this is my winter notebook. <clears throat> and here you see the spring notebook. So I will have a notebook for every season. And this is the winter one. I used um, snow and cocoa for my cover. And for most of my pages. And I'm um, showing you a close-up on the cover. Here you see that I used those Nouveau drops in white. And I mentioned before that they flatten out if they're like in a book or on layout and they are like something is lying on top of them. After a time, they tend to flatten out a little bit. So, here you see my first page. I used those um, calendars for the months of winter, December, January and February. And on February I marked the birthday of my daughter. That's kind of like my introduction page. And I used bits and pieces from Snow and Cocoa. On my first spread, I documented that I received um, a message from Wild Whisper that I will be guest designing for them. And I used my first order or the papers from my first order to document that. If you are not familiar with Wild Whisper, it's a new scrapbooking company from Canada and I will link their web website in the description box below. Here you see my first layout. I used Snow and Coco exclusively except for that snowflake sticker. Next page, I documented just a few things from home, that we had a cat now, and my son and his buddy. Here are pictures from my daughter, some more pictures from home, and you can find process videos to almost all of the pages. I will link them down below, or I will link the uh, playlist for those. This one, I don't think there is a, no, there's no process for this one. And I will glue that, those white pages together. And there's no process video, video for this one either. And this is my last page. There I just uh, wrote something about our winter, that we didn't have snow and you can see that I marked off that we had to wear mittens, we had hot cocoa, we had happiness, but we didn't have any snowman because there was no snow here. But we still... and we didn't have lots and lots of fluffy snow, no way, but we did love each other. So that was my winter notebook and it's not stapled yet and I will now take it out and we'll have it stapled like at a copy shop or something because my stapler won't do it here. So yeah, now we'll keep it there and start working with my spring notebook.
here I used um, some lightweight cardstock for the winter notebook I used copy paper and that's yeah that's too thin you can see through and I had to glue pages together in order to have like a clean white page so it doesn't bother me but you can just use some thin cardstock and don't have to worry about it so yeah that's my winter notebook um, I hope you like this share video and I will have some more pictures of every layout if you want to check out the process videos I will link them down below and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye. Thank you.